So obviously this is a saxophone and this is a steaming hot cup of tea. Oh, that's actually really good. But what's making a cup of tea got to do with playing saxophone? Well, the two are actually really linked. Let me explain. When you go and make yourself a cup of tea, it's that easy. You think about making the cup of tea and your body does the rest. But why don't we do that with our saxophone playing too? I've just put out a new video on YouTube where I break down the process of how our thinking about saxophone playing actually makes the biggest difference to the way that we improve. Let me explain to you in three easy steps. First of all, we need to have a concept of the sound that we want on our saxophone. Then we need to spend time imagining playing our saxophone without actually playing our saxophone. And the third most important step is to spend time visualizing actually playing the piece that we're working on perfectly. Now there's so much more we can talk about this, but if you can put those three things into action right now into your saxophone practice, it's possibly the most important thing you can do to see fast progress on your saxophone. Oh, that's really good.